Hi, I'm Alicia, and this is the Cricut Design Studio software. Today, I'm going to show you how it works. In this box, you get the following items. Cricut Design Studio software on CD, Design Studio user manual and quick install guide, Cricut mouse pad, and a custom Cricut USB cable. Before you install the Cricut Design Studio software, be sure to read pages 4 through 7 of the user manual and the quick install guide. Then you'll make sure you have all the information you need to get started. We'll cover proper installation of the software in a different segment, but for now I'm going to show you some things about Design Studio. To launch the Cricut Design Studio, double click on the Design Studio icon on your desktop or choose Design Studio from your programs list in the start menu. It takes a few seconds for your cartridge content to load, so in the meantime, I'm going to tell you a few things about Design Studio and then some of the things it can do. Cricut Design Studio is a software package that gives you greater design power with Cricut content. You can affect the look of any Cricut image by resizing it, rotating it, flipping it, stretching it, or skewing it. You can even weld from any combination of cartridge sets. The only limit is your imagination. Looks like we're ready, so let's get started. Okay, the Design Studio is up. Let's briefly explore the layout of the program. Across the top, you'll see six menus. File, Edit, View, Features, Preferences, and Help. Below the menus, we have the Cartridge Library window. Next to that is the Virtual Keypad Overlay. And next to that is the Shape Properties window. Now, down here, we have the Virtual Mat. And over on the left side here, we have some helpful function buttons. We've made sure to put most of the functions you will use right out where you can see them, but there are a few others you'll find in the menus along the top. Let's look a bit closer at what these menus contain. The File menu lets you start a new project, open an existing project, close the current project, save the current project, cut your project with the Cricut, or exit the program. The Edit menu gives you the option to undo your last action, redo your last action, copy a selection, or paste a selection you've copied. Notice the hotkeys next to some of the options. This means you can use this combination of keys on your keyboard to perform the same command. The Edit menu also gives you the option to delete your selected shape, delete all your shapes, or revert all your selected shapes back to their original state. The View menu lets you add a new page to your project, delete the current page from your project, preview how the Cricut will cut what you've designed so far, clear that preview, keep your preview as a matte background watermark, show or hide the ruler on the edges of the mat, change your virtual mat size, and change the zoom level you see your project at with mat view. The Features menu lists all the features in a cartridge set and corresponds to whatever Cricut cartridge you're currently using from the library. You can select which